Welcome to the latest episode of the Zotac Video Podcast. Today, we'll be taking a look at the new Zotac Ion ITX F series. Inside the box, you'll find a rear I.O. plate, a quick install guide, a user manual with a driver CD inside, three SATA cables, an optional fan, the screws to attach the optional fan, a Molex to SATA power adapter, a Wi-Fi antenna, and of course, the F-Series motherboard itself. The board features NVIDIA's ION graphics processor with an Intel Atom 330 dual-core processor. It can be passively cooled or, in tight cases, pa actively cooled with the included optional fan. Instead of running the usual suite of benchmarks, today we'll show you how to build a whisper quiet, Blu-ray capable home theater PC using the Zotac ION ITX F-Series motherboard. In addition to the Zotac ION ITX F-Series motherboard, we'll be installing two 2 gig modules of DDR2800 Kingston value RAM memory, a 64 gigabyte Kingston SSD now V-Series solid state drive for storage, a Silverstone TOB02 Blu-ray drive kit, and lastly, a Silverstone La Scala LC09 Mini ITX case with a stylish aluminum front cover and expansion capabilities to fit one expansion card, which is perfect for the Zotac ON ITX F series in case you wanted to install a TV tuner or other PCI Express X16 expansion card. Since the Silverstone La Scala LC09 does not have a cooling fan, and the stock optional fan for the Zotac ION ITX F series is too high for the case, we had to make a custom mount for the CPU and GPU fan to provide proper airflow throughout the case. As we finish building our Blu-ray capable home theater PC, we'll discuss the software we'll be using. Our operating system of choice is Microsoft's latest Windows 7 Ultimate 64-bit edition. We'll be pairing Windows 7 with the latest CyberLink Power DVD 9 Ultra Edition with support for Blu-ray playback and high-resolution audio decoding. We'll also be installing Adobe Flash Player 10.1 Beta for high-resolution, high-definition streaming video playback. The reason we've opted for Windows 7 is due to its enhanced multimedia capabilities with enhanced video playback and the improved Media Center application with a very TV-friendly user interface. We'll be navigating the Windows desktop using a home theater PC friendly Logitech DeNovo Mini thumb keyboard with mouse controls. The Media Center application provides access to live TV with a programming guide and DVR capabilities if you have a TV tuner installed. If you do not have a TV tuner installed, you can also access the internet TV features provided by Microsoft and its content partners such as CBS. Since the internet TV feature is powered by Adobe Flash technology, it can play back smoothly using Adobe Flash Player 10.1 Beta. This is thanks to the NVIDIA ION graphics processor found in the Zotac ION ITX F-Series motherboard. Without the ION graphics processor, the system would be unable to render Adobe Flash content smoothly for video playback. Media Center will also let you manage your movie library, as well as play a DVD movie. It will also let you stream live movies instantly directly from your Netflix account. Media Center also lets you manage your music library and play back various music files such as MP3s and Windows Media Audio formats. If you have a compatible radio tuner or a TV tuner with built-in radio tuner, Windows Media will also let you listen to your favorite radio stations as well. Pictures and video files can also be viewed and managed using the Media Center user interface. One of the most notable features of the Zotac ON ITX F-Series motherboard is the ability to play back Blu-ray movies smoothly while using minimal CPU cycles and relying only on the ION graphics processor alone. We've we'll shown these capabilities using the Transformers 2 Blu-ray movie. As you can see, the menus are very fluid, including the background video presented to you in 1080p. 
Since the Zotac Ion ITX S-Series platform features HDMI output with 8-channel digital PCM audio output, you can enjoy the latest high-resolution DTS-HD Master Audio soundtracks from the movie. These soundtracks can have up to 24 bits of resolution and 192 kHz sampling rate for true high-fidelity audio paired with your high-definition 1080p movie. Thanks to the latest Adobe Flash Player 10.1 beta, you can also watch TV shows and other video content from Hulu.com or using the Hulu desktop application smoothly in their high definition quality settings using the highly energy efficient Zotac Ion ITX F series platform. That concludes this episode of the Zotac Video Podcast. Thank you for joining us.